I think mixed reality is certainly one of the complementary tools that's now available. Uh, and instead of only focusing on the core material that's available and of course textbooks and uh, things that they can learn from internet, now we have a tool that can allow them to really learn in a practical manner on various fronts, for example, doing procedural skills, doing patient communication skills, or even learning anatomy in a much faster and fun way. Traditionally, when we teach the students, the nursing students, we teach them in the nursing lab. That's quite labour intensive. There's a lot of logistics to organise as well. So what happens is that the students take turn to do their practice and it can be quite time consuming. With the mixed reality, actually it's more efficient because the students can get undivided attention in terms of our time. It is more efficient. It is also more flexible and the students can sign up you know, and come for their practice whenever they feel you like or in their convenience, yeah. So the HoloLens definitely boosts my confidence because for procedures that I haven't learned, I'm able to follow step-by-step -step procedure guides and I'm able to watch videos and there are also 3D images which I can turn and pen and then look from different angles and then get practice my procedures from different sides. What the HoloLens does is that it allows us to go step by step and guides us with the useful 3D models and videos. I mean, to be honest, I feel that the juniors who are coming up are quite lucky to have this resource amongst them. I think HoloLens really helped to improve patient experience because it really helped nursing students and medicine students practice our skills and hone them better before we head to clinical attachment and we can make less mistakes. We can practice without a tutor but with a tutor in that sense. HoloLens allows students, especially beginners, to have a step-by-step -step guide on doing a specific procedure, such as venue puncture. This procedure can be tough sometimes as finding a vein on patient can be difficult. With HoloLens, it allows us to better visualize and make mistakes while maintaining patient safety. HoloLens is going to change the way how we train healthcare professionals, maybe in Singapore, in the region and in the world. I always say that the best way to predict our future is to create it. And so it's really up to our imagination how we want to use HoloLens 2 and mixed reality devices in our day-to-day -day practice. From the educational perspective, we can have students each you know, have a HoloLens. We can upload different modules on the HoloLens itself. They can either use it in school, they can use it at home. Students at home can link up all the HoloLens devices for you know, group discussions, group sharings, and all this can be done in a remote fashion. And at the end of the day is to you know, really make a difference to the next patient that walks in through the hospital doors. Fundamentally, Microsoft is a tools and platform company. So mixed reality is just one of our many tools. When you bring in technologies like artificial intelligence, security, all that comes together to create the kind of new reality that we all live in. And we're really counting on our partners and our customers to reimagine the way they conduct their businesses and think about how they can optimize their operations with all of these technologies.